is going to be a styling video. I'm super excited about this one because jeans for me are a staple in my wardrobe. They're so comfortable and you can style them a bunch of different ways. I definitely wanted to get this video up now because if you've been shopping recently, you've noticed that in stores fall stuff is coming out already. So I thought this video would be really helpful for some style inspiration for your upcoming back to school shopping or fall shopping in general. I'm also super excited to say that this video is in collaboration with Express for their Fit For You campaign. So I'm gonna show you guys three key new styles, flare, girlfriend, and legging. So I really hope you guys enjoy this and let's get started. Starting off with the flare jeans, I went for a very 70s vibe with this first outfit because I love the fact that fashion is getting recycled and this is a huge trend right now. Plus, you guys know I love my boho style, so this is honestly one of my favorite looks from the video. But starting off with the jeans, of course, I'm wearing the light wash distressed slim flare jean from Express. And a tip for you, if you think that they're a bit long, is to wear them with some chunky heels to not only avoid alterations, but also to elongate your legs. So for the rest of the outfit, I wore this embroidered fringe top from Free People paired with a necklace and a brown leather jacket from Express. Moving on to outfit number two, I decided to tone down the 70s vibes in case that isn't for you because I wanted to show you guys that you can still wear flare jeans without going full 70s style. So I decided to use the same distressed flare jeans from before, but in case these aren't your style, they do make a sailor style flare jean which you can get a completely different look from. But for my look, I decided to wear an olive color blouse from All Saints and my go-to layer jewelry with of course my favorite Clubmaster sunglasses. And since you guys know I love fringe, I decided to wear a fringe black jacket from Express and then I wanted to add some light color with my cream colored bag, so I did that. But overall, I think this is a look I'm definitely gonna rock this fall. Okay, so now on to the girlfriend jean. The jeans that I'm wearing are the light wash distressed girlfriend jean and what I specifically love about these is that it has more of a tapered fit than a boyfriend fit does. So it's a little bit slimmer in the thigh which I love because then it doesn't look like I'm drowning in them. So overall this jean is actually perfect for me since I'm a little bit more petite. So how I styled it was pretty simple. I just wore a black bodysuit from American Apparel and then a belt from Shopbop for a little added texture. Over it, I wore a poncho from Express, and a tip for you when wearing something as heavy as something like this is to wear something a little bit tighter underneath it, like I did, so it doesn't look like you're swimming in your outfit. And then lastly, since you know I love booties and they're my favorite, I wore just some simple black ones from Rag & Bone. For this next outfit, I thought I would keep it even more simple, so again, I wore the same girlfriend jeans from before, but this time I kept it casual with the super comfy Express 111 v-neck tee. And since tees like this are simple and easy to wear, you can really style it with anything. So I thought it would look cool with some studded sandals like these ones, which are a huge trend right now, a layered tassel necklace from Express, and one of my favorite black floppy hats from Rag & Bone. And one of my favorite things about keeping an outfit simple like this is that you can layer it really easily. So I did that with an army jacket from Target. Now moving on to the legging style jean. This style of jean has always been my go-to because it's so versatile and you can style it a bunch of different ways. So the jeans that I'm wearing are the white mid-rise legging. These are super comfy and I've been loving them. So again, it kept it simple by wearing an Express 111 v-neck tee over it because it's super comfy and who doesn't love just a t-shirt and jeans? It's probably my go-to way to style things so I definitely wanted to include it in here. And for shoes, I thought I would make it a little bit dressier by wearing some black strappy sandals. And then lastly, for a fun layering element, I added this black and white fringe sweater from the Couples. Overall, this is something I would wear on a dinner night out or a casual day if I switched up the shoes. Now this last style of jean is still a legging, but what's different about this from the last one is that it is performance stretch. So what that means is it's basically made with a new fabric that's supposed to retain its shape throughout the day and not stretch out like normal jeans. So I actually put it to the test and wore them throughout the day and filmed this last outfit just before sundown. So I guess you can be the judge. So for my night look, I wore this floral top from Intermix. It's very light and flowy, I love it. And I paired that with my go-to layer necklaces. Over it, I wore a green utility jacket from Express. And then lastly, for my strappy sandals, I purchased those at Shopbop. 
that's it for my video today. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked any of my outfits, I will have some shoppable links below for you guys. Also, check the description box for a giveaway from Express. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!